Christy over here from Scarlet's Performance. Take you inside, show you the shop real quick. A uh, little bit of what we're working on. Normally what we do over here is plastic vehicles and LS swaps, things of that nature. Uh, we do dabble a little bit in racing. Uh, starting to get into this VK56 project here. Uh, prototyping a few parts. So we're still pretty early in the prototyping phase here. These are 3D printed models of what we're going to end up having. It will be for a non-VVTI, so these gears will not be here. Uh, We'll have a spot somewhere on the intake cam for you to pick up your cam sensor. And each one will come with the pressure tap for oil feed to the turbos or to pick up oil pressure. Here for the water pump cover, uh, it will come with the option of a welded on 20 AN or a 20 port to put whatever fitting you need into it. Uh, all said and done, they will be billet pocketed like weight and any BK 5060E. So you can see here we're about to get started on 3D scanning and intake manifold. It will be coming in the options of just intake flanges or a full billet intake manifold. Uh, we'll talk a little bit more about that in a future video. From the 3D scanner we move over here into our 3D modeling software. Uh, you can see here we're back onto the timing cover. Eventually, we will include a spot here for your cam sensor. Could be moved depending on your ECU. We'll take suggestions on that. Uh, but we basically took a 3D scan of our uh, cam cover, put it into the software, extruded from it, and we're going to use that to make a billet cover for your aftermarket ECU. From the 3D modeling software, we come over here to our 3D printers. Uh, it's where we do a lot of our early prototyping, make sure we're hitting all the right bolt holes, uh, contours are correct, things like that. We do make some production pieces on the 3D printer. This is a carbon fiber reinforced 3D printed switch box. We run it in all of our race cars here. Uh, good looking piece, it's meant to mount onto an inch and five eighths roll bar. Uh, we normally go from the 3D printing back into the modeling software to convert it to run into our CNC machine where we're able to make the billet finished pieces. This is our CNC mill. Uh, this is where we build all of our billet pieces, just like this NLS oil block here. Uh, eventually the BK56 cam covers, uh, water pump lock off, things like that will be made in here. Uh, we do a little bit of anodizing here as well, black, red, gold, whatever color you're looking for. So over the next couple weeks, we're gonna be taking scans of the intake surface here in the back of the motor to have our billet intake manifold made and an adapter kit with a flex plate to adapt the Turbo 400 to the VK56. The main purpose of this post is to gauge your interest and see what parts you think need to be made for the VK56 platform. To reach out to us, uh, go to our website, scarletsperformance.com. Uh, there's a chat bot, you feel free to chat. I answer those personally. Uh, or you can get our contact information through there. That'll be in the link down below.